That sounds really good. All right, we could all use some good news on a Friday, right? And what's better than being able to go out and do things again? The Flying W Ranch in Colorado Springs is reopening today. It was destroyed eight years ago by the Waldo Canyon fire, and then the pandemic put the reopening on hold, but they will be back at it today. Also today, it is the grand opening of the Denver Zoo's Animal Hospital. It's not just a regular animal hospital either. The zoo says guests will get an immersive, unprecedented look at the veterinary team in action. The hospital opens to the public on June 1st. And finally, we've been talking about this. Rosie is back. The Butterfly Pavilion in Broomfield says the Chilean rose hair tarantula will be back crawling on guest hands starting next Friday. You've got to be over three years old. More than three million guests have held Rosie over the past 25 years. <laughs> three million guests. I'm guessing there's more than one Rosie, but that's just a guess. <laughs> anyway, that same day, Butterfly Pavilion also says they will start their extended summer hours. That'll be from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. We have, except for Natasha, we have held Rosie on this show. Oh, I have not either. Uh -uh. Oh, I have you a didn't? fear of spiders. Yeah, there's no way here. Rosie's oh, coming you didn't? in. Uh -huh. oh, Rosie's been here. on this. Death. No, I oh. ran. I ran. There's no <laughs> No way. offense to Rosie, but yeah, did not love that video. Not a tarantula mm. fan. No. Mm. Very mm. sweet. Very sweet spider. <laughs> totally. Yeah. They said they have, what, 25, I think, that like are in rotation. Right. So it's like a bunch of different yeah. Rosies. Yeah. yeah. wonder if you have to audition to be a Rosie. <laughs> I don't know, but I remember my kids held Rosie uh -huh. and, and my daughter, it, she she hates bees, spiders, all that kind of and stuff. She did it. And she did it. She closed her eyes and did it. Go, Rachel. But she mm -hmm. did it. Wow. Yeah. All right.